We've got some McNews coming out of Australia and New Zealand today. It's very exciting. Howdy bitches, it's me, Noah Galoot. Guess what? McDonald's is serving butter pies! Over in New Zealand, they've introduced hand pies filled with butter chicken. Now, butter chicken is a popular Indian mild curry, which, oddly enough, came up recently in another episode of the show. Anyway, the point is, now, McDonald's is ruining it for New Zealand. Now, they're only gonna be ruining butter chicken for a limited time, though, and they're doing it alongside a plum and custard pie, which is also a hand pie. It's filled with a custard filling, and plums, which, unlike my own, which are very bitter, is more on the sweet side. McDonald's has offered these sort of of portable pot pies in the past. They did a chicken and vegetable version at one point, as well as a steak, mince, and cheese one back in 2013. Now, if this were a list of uh, multiple choice pies, my answer would be D. None of the above, go f yourself. Moving over to Australia, McDonald's is trying to class up their breakfast game with something that they're calling gourmet breakfast. That's gourmet from McDonald's, which means it is a lie. Now, the main item from this experiment is the cafe breakfast platter, which has sourdough toast, bacon, chipolata sausage, which is some kind of a breakfast sausage, scrambled eggs, wilted spinach, grilled tomatoes, a hash brown, and tomato relish. Now this would sound great as a breakfast if it weren't made from a place which I'm fairly sure is McDonald's. Other gourmet breakfast offerings include an avocado smash bladder, which has a sourdough toast from McDonald's, then it has a mashed avocado from McDonald's, spinach from McDonald's, tomato uh, from McDonald's, and a crumbled feta, which uh, is uh, from McDonald's. The bacon and egg roll has all the foods that would be indicated by its name, along with spinach and tomato relish yet again. Also, the roll is a brioche-style bun from McDonald's. Then you got yourself the uh, corn fritter platter, which is avocado, grilled tomato, tomato relish, spinach, and crumbled feta. Now, if you're not paying attention, you might not have noticed that these are all basically the same f***ing eight ingredients, all Tetris together to different permutations of the entire menu of this f***ing gourmet platter sh Also, uh, from McDonald's. The last fancy offering in the lineup is uh, Belgian waffles, which come with yogurt and fruit. Though I would not be surprised if the waffle batter is made out of feta cheese and tomato relish also from McDonald's. Now, I know that we have some feeders in both Australia and New Zealand, so if you'd like to report back with your thoughts on these new offerings, uh, feel free, but I gotta tell you my suggestion. Let's go back to our old recipe videos and uh, cook some of the food on there, like a nice little bolognese, a little uh, sausage tomato sauce, and then eat that, because in my understanding, if you go to McDonald's and you eat that food, you'll be eating food uh, from McDonald's. Hey, that's it for us, guys. I'm Noah Galutin. Subscribe to Taste It for all sorts of food feeder updates on things like new hand pies and fake gourmet breakfast relishes. Uh, I'm not sure where they're from, but uh, I'm sure we can try to figure it out for you. From McDonald's. <laughs>